Hi, this is On Your Mark. Today we're gonna check out beautiful Hollywood, Florida. To help me today, I have Wendy Burian. Hello. Tell me about yourself a little bit and tell me what is it like to live here in beautiful South Florida. It's hot, it's humid, it's wonderful. <laughs> she's a local resident here in Hollywood, Florida, and she's gonna tell us some more about how is it to live here, how has it changed over the years. Um, well, Hollywood, downtown Hollywood is really nice, as Mark mentioned. Um, there's a lot of stores, a lot of um, tourists in this area. Everything right now in this area is a little pricey, but you can actually go to um, downtown Hollywood a little further down, closer to the beach. And you can buy things that are more affordable, like keychains, bracelets, towels, things like that. They added the uh, Margarita, Margaritaville um, resort. Yeah, so the biggest thing in Hollywood right now, apparently, yes. is the Margaritaville. It just opened up down the road here on the beach. There's also the huge expansion to the Hard Rock. Yes. So the Hard Rock Hotel and Casino is one of the main places, one of the biggest tourist attractions here in South Florida. Which I can't show you this time because it's under reconstruction. Maybe next time. Right now, we're here in downtown Hollywood. You can see around me, it's a really beautiful, awesome, lively area. And it's a popular place for people to live and move to now. There's condos going up everywhere. Back behind me, as far as you can go this way, this is Hollywood Boulevard. This is the whole downtown area. So at night, there's a lot of nightlife. There's uh, a lot of beautiful shops around here, a lot of good restaurants. This is a really great place to come to. Also, if you want a walkable area, one of the few walkable areas in South Florida you can live in, this particular area is good for that. This area, the downtown area. If you go outside of here, a few blocks, it's not. This area is a walkable, fun, nice area. So I'm gonna show you around today. Okay, right now we're here in Club Spice. We're gonna get a drink, we're gonna chill for a little bit. Um, at night, this is one of the best, coolest nightclubs in downtown Hollywood. Okay, now we're here at Young Circle in downtown Hollywood. It's one of the main center parts. So if you live in this area in Hollywood, the park is the main place to come to. There's a lot of concerts here that happen, a lot of big community events, a lot of things go on in this area. So this park is a pretty prominent feature here in Hollywood. Now, to get here, once you get to that park, you park somewhere down the main street here. Did you just say, Wendy? <laughs> this is parking valid until 8 o'clock p.m. And what time is it now? 7.58. And what's gonna happen in two minutes time? We have to get a parking ticket somewhere. I just don't know where. I'm looking for one. So we have parking issues here and somewhere where all you can do is drive and park. Yes. Welcome <laughs> to Florida. You have to park and pay, basically. Park and pay to have fun. 
park and pay to have fun. Yes, it's true. So you have to park somewhere down here, which is the whole main nightlife area where all the restaurants are and everything. Once you get to the actual circle though, there is way less going on around here. It gets more residential, it gets much quieter as you go further down. They're building new condos and things here. It's more of a residential area once you get past this circling around here. So even though it's a place with, with a lot of um, events and entertainment, most of it's down this way that I just showed you. But this is becoming more of the neighborhood quiet area. I mean, the rents here, I believe, are very, very high because this is a nice, beautiful, walkable area. There's a lot of things going on here at night. And anywhere you can actually walk in South Florida, which is because it's rare to walk in South Florida, anywhere you can actually do it, is very, very, very expensive and pricey beyond normal expensive South Florida real estate prices. True or false? True. Okay. So we're gonna show you around the park here, the Young Circle. Harlow is actually kind of special in the way that it's one of the first planned communities in all of South Florida. So when you look at the road system out here, it's uh, pretty organized and a lot of straight lines and neighborhoods designed in a way that is supposed to be pretty quick and efficient to get around. Not as much today with the traffic, but back when they built it, it was. And they have these large parks and circles. So we saw the presidential circle recently. And the presidential circle is, is one of the like main square center areas in Hollywood. But I would say Young Circle would be the most prominent one because they did a full redesign of this area a few years ago. It's uh, a lot of recreational stuff to see here, a lot of biking paths, a lot of families. There's a lot of families here pushing their kids and their strollers around. It's a much more residential neighborhood. It's a much more um, entertainment neighborhood. There's a lot of things going on in this area. Have you ever seen the show Burn Notice? Yes, I have. It's a good show, right? Yes. All right. In the show Burn Notice, they did a few episodes here in Hollywood, okay? They did a whole like finale scene over there in the Hollywood Bread Building. And they also did several scenes down this street here, um, which is the main downtown Hollywood area. But they called the South Beach. Why? Because it has a similar vibe to South Beach. here at Hollywood Beach. Big, beautiful spot. Amazing, gorgeous boardwalk. This is where you come to at night. You can come here to relax, play beach games, activities, check out the sights, the club, the nightlife. This is an amazing, fun area to come to here in Hollywood. Hollywood Beach. Like I said, there's very few areas in South Florida that are walkable. So the ones that are, are very, very full, very, very busy, very packed, and have a lot of things going on. So this area has a lot of entertainment. Hey guys. Yeah, this area has a lot of entertainment. This area has a lot of action, has a lot of residential people who just live in the area, who like to hang out. A lot of people all around the city who come here, and a lot of tourists that come here and visit. This is Hollywood Beach. Because we're in South Florida, the water here is always warm. Almost the entire year you're gonna get nice, warm, comfortable water. You can go swim most of the, most of the year. It's always summer, so very few days it'll be a little cool, but most of the time you could just come here with your bathing suit, just relax on the beach, get a suntan, almost all year. The 
city along the beach in South Florida has their own separate vibe, has their own way to, to develop the beach and do things. I would have to say Hollywood is one of my favorites. Not only you can walk here, but they have a big beautiful boardwalk that stretches all the way down. You can ride, uh, you can ride bikes down it, you can stroll, you can jog. There's restaurants, there's all sorts of things, and one of the big main things that most beaches don't have is everything is right up along the beach. Everything you want to see here is right along the beach here. You don't have to have big streets and cars and buses and things going between it. You can just be right on the beach, right in the action, enjoy, enjoy the nightlife, enjoy the scenery. Hello! Hello! And just have fun. As you know, I really hate cars and I think they are big dividers for cities in many ways. So to have a place where you can actually be right in the city and right on the water is a very rare thing and I think Hollywood has done it right. There's a lot of cool hotels out here, a lot of uh, pools you can just relax. A lot of events happen here, concerts. this is where you come to here in Hollywood Beach well you definitely want to see the beach South Florida and Broward County this is one of the main places to go this was on your mark if you like this video please like comment and consider subscribing